It's huge. Uh, this is a big win for us. Got us bowl eligible. Got us back on back on track where we want to go. Um, we're all excited. I mean, it was a huge win, especially coming from last year, losing to Virginia. Uh, it meant a lot to us, honestly. Describe the play, the, the leap, all that kind of thing, what you saw moving forward. Um, I came across. Uh, I saw that the backer blitzed, and I knew Kyle was going to throw it. He threw it right to me, and then I just – it kind of just happened. I just saw him in front of me. Most defenders try to go for my legs because I'm tied in, and so I just jumped over him. Uh, in my JUCO, I did it one time. So, yeah. Uh, actually, it happened the same thing. I got hit right after I jumped over him. I, I, I got him, but I got hit right after. So. When you do that, are you at all like, uh, maybe I should have done this? Or, I mean, what are you doing? Um, not yet. I haven't gotten hit when I'm trying. So, so far, I think I'll keep doing it if it happens. But. <laughs> Um, yeah, I mean, it's just how it happens, really. Um, any tight end in our room can make big plays. But uh, it's been fun. It's been like, I feel like I'm finally getting in the groove of things, finally adjusting to ACC football, and hopefully keep doing the things I'm doing. So. Was, there, was there any frustrating time during the first few weeks? I know your head's going back from your, I guess your shoulder, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, it was, obviously I want to play, but I want whoever is the best player out there to play. So if I'm not what the coaches think during that week, then that's fine with me. I'm going to ride with my tight ends and try to get this dub. So. What, do you, uh, uh, what is it that you know that you're going to be able to do well out there as far as the season or the team as far as just knowing things you can do? Uh, I think creating mismatches is probably my biggest thing. Um, when we go spread out like that, they most, most of the time they put either – a safety who is smaller than me or a linebacker who's slower than me. So that's probably my role as in our offense right now. This team started 0-3. What kept you together? Uh, it's a brotherhood in the locker room. Um, we're a family. The coaches kept pushing us. Uh, we didn't change our mindset at all this year. Um, we just kept pushing forward and then finally gelled together. So, How do you keep that confidence? I mean, you, you lose three in a row. How do you, what, where does that confidence come from that you can I think the fact that uh, we were in all the games we did lose was a big, big deal. Also, um, I mean, we push each other every day. They want us, the coaches want us to do good, but uh, as a team, we all want to do good as well. So, I mean, it's definitely a self-motivated team, I'd say. Um. I'm not really sure, honestly. Kyle throws me the ball, and kind of I just try to go make a play. But um, as quarterback-wise, we have, as you can see, anyone can really play quarterback on our team. So. Um, we did in off-season workouts. Yeah. I uh, I got 36 and a half on it. Does it feel like? Um, than the previous one, I mean, sorry. This one was big, I think, for us, especially losing to them last year. Um, even though I wasn't here, uh, it definitely was a sour taste in the players' mouths, the coaches' mouths. So this was a big win for us. But any win is a good win, so. No, not one bit. Um, our off-season work that we did. We trusted our coaching. Um, we trusted our strength staff. We knew that we'd be ready and that we could bounce back.